Hello friends, in this video we make 3 nitrophthalic acid. Three nitrophthalic acid is formed by the direct nitration of thalic anhydride. It acts as a ligand forming complexes with many rare earth elements. Our plan is to make luminol. Materials required for this preparation includes 8 grams of thalic anhydride, 7.6 milliliters each of 98% sulfuric acid and 68% nitric acid. Start by fixing a 250 milliliters 3 neck round bottom flask on a stand and then start adding the 8 grams of thalic anhydride to it. Thalic anhydride can be obtained by heating thalic acid, thereby removing the water of hydration. Once all the thalic anhydride is added, we first add 7.6 milliliters of 68% nitric acid slowly. On top of that was added another 7.6 milliliters of 98% sulfuric acid. A mixture of both concentrated nitric acid and concentrated sulfuric acid together forms the nitrating mixture which is going to nitrate our thalic anhydride. The reaction needs a little bit of heat so we place the flask in boiling water bath with stirring for about 2 hours. You can see a lot of fumes being produced and there is some brown gas being formed which is the nitrogen dioxide. What is happening here is the direct nitration of thalic anhydride in the presence of concentrated sulfuric acid and heat. It produces a mixture containing both 3 nitro and the 4 nitro thalic acid. After about 2 hours, the nitration is almost complete and a lot of nitrogen dioxide gas is produced. By the end of the reaction, you can already see a lot of nitrogen dioxide fumes in the round bottom flask and it is very dark brown in color inside the flask. What we do next is to pour the contents of the flask to about 300 milliliters of ice cold distilled water. You immediately see a yellow precipitate being formed. This is actually a mixture of 3 nitrophthalic acid and the 4 nitro compound. 4 nitro compound is yellow in color and the 3 nitro compound is white, but yellow stands out. The precipitate is then filtered out by simple gravity filtration method because my dream of getting a vacuum filtration setup is still a dream. And here we have the crude product. Now we dissolve the entire crude product in 50 milliliters of hot water. The solubility of 4 nitrothalic acid is much higher than the 3 nitro compound. So both of them dissolve in a minimal amount of hot water but on cooling the 3 nitro compound precipitates out but the 4 nitro compound will remain in solution. After that on filtering we will get much purer white colored 3 nitro phthalic acid. After the filtration we are left with this much purer 3 nitro thalic acid you can see that it is much white in color compared to the previous crude one. Let me take this opportunity to remind you guys that you can support me financially via Patreon or PayPal. The links are given in the description and these are those wonderful guys who are helping me out in my experiments financially. Thank you so much for watching once again do subscribe to the channel and click on the bell button for notifications regarding my new videos. So yeah, that's about it in this video. Thank you.